to our gallery. My name is Judy Myler, and this is our gallery space, Uptown Artworks. This is Carol Motes. Uh, I teach watercolor classes and calligraphy classes in this space. Beautiful light, and every artist here has a, a, a piece exhibited. In so, this main gallery. There's 12 studio artists here at this time. We have room for more. So follow us back to our studio. And here's some of our studio artists now. Studio artists. <coughs> this is mine and Carol's studio that we share. I do oil paintings and Carol on the design. That's watercolors. That's watercolors. Some of my watercolors. And I do a few oils, but mostly watercolors. I think that's my first love. And I do oils, that's my first love, and I like to do florals. I have uh, several plein air landscapes, and this on the easel is my latest Salvation Army honor card. Almost ready for the press. Frances Baker is also an experimental artist. She works in works beautifully in many media. Both are so pleased to be part of Uptown Artworks family. It is a creative community all on its own. Johnson. I'm a multimedia artist, but my biggest love is water media. I work from anywhere from really loose realism to total abstraction. I've been painting all of my life, and um, these are just the most recent ones. Um, I have a whole warehouse full, practically. Um, I have work here locally in the permanent collection at the Cone Cancer Center, and um, I have work all over the United States and in several foreign countries. I love to get in and work directly with the paint and let it tell me where it wants to go. So my painting is very emotional and in the moment. Hi, I'm Jay Bruni. I specialize in contemporary and modern abstract artwork. Um, I'm 
here at Uptown Studios Artworks. And uh, these are some of the pieces I've been working on recently. Um, this is a piece, an abstract that I did. And you, you just never know exactly where you'll get your inspiration for your pieces. Um, art is all around you, and you just have to remember that. How you doing, Lee? Okay. You ready for me now? Uh, yep. How you doing, Paul? Hi, Joe. Hi. Uh, I'm Paul DeLorenzo. Well, I'm working on a Bellini copy, Giovanni Bellini copy for the Ebenezer Lutheran Church. I'm a portrait painter. If you're interested in seeing my work, just Google Paul DeLorenzo artist, and a number of things will pop up. Um, it's kind of, I've already done one for the church. Uh, it's another Bellini. And, um, Gee, what do I say? <laughs> Lee? Yes, sir. Huh? Tell us about yourself, please. What? Tell us about yourself. Well, uh, I'm 88 years old. Uh, and uh, I find the joy of painting as uh, just very stimulating for me. Uh, something I wake up for every morning and I go to work on it every day. Uh, uh, it means that I maintain my relevancy despite the fact that I'm getting pretty old. And uh, I just feel that I'm very thoroughly engaged in it. And it's the most pleasurable activity I think I've ever had. I'm a lawyer and I practice law for 53 years. Uh, and uh, now uh, I'm a full-time painter. Uh, oils, this is an oil here, painted on commission. Uh, and uh, uh, pastels, uh, uh, my principal uh, means of painting. But uh, uh, I think uh, watercolors are wonderful, but I, I'm not very good at that. <laughs> and uh, so I, I, I say I paint pastels and oils. But, uh, I find that being in this group here with this, these many different artists in, in different mediums uh, gives us an exchange of ideas and, and stimulates our interest a lot and keeps us going. So uh, uh, this is a place for you to come see art in the making. Oh yes, we might mention the space is great for workshops. Mm -hmm. 